I've worked in the military uh, going on 17 years uh, this year. I've been in two war zones. Um, I've had to deal with my own mortality. I've had to deal with people much younger than me uh, not making it. Uh, certainly not children, but uh, compared to my age at this point, kind of, kind of our kids. Um, and I can say definitively that no matter what I've experienced in a war zone, the horrors and everything that you hear about, read about, and can possibly think about, none of it would prepare you for your own child to go through cancer. Um, it all pales, I, I don't in any way hold it insignificant, but it all kind of pales and does not compare or does not prepare you uh, for what you face when one of your own family members is threatened by cancer, especially one of your children. And then um, how is it how is it harder? I think it's harder uh, when your child has cancer than in a wartime scenario uh, because I am very much uh, as the father in the family, I'm supposed to be protecting my family members. And if I take a chronic disease like cancer uh, and that's threatening, the lives of one of my children, there is nothing that I can do tangible uh, or definitively uh, that helps protect them from this scenario. It is very much uh, in many ways out of my hands at that point. It's very frustrating uh, because I've always viewed my role in my family as a protector and, and this is a case where I not a lot I can do about it. We compared Gabby's fight, though, to a war zone. We, we often thought about it in those terms, and maybe it's because we're a military family and that's kind of how we talk. But she was our warrior princess. She will always be our warrior princess. She fought hard. We, we used to say things like, she's battling in the trenches or, um, you know, fighting a battle. It, it, it was always somewhat military, militant type conversation that because that, that seemed like the comparison. It was just so bad. It was like she was on the front lines and, and she was very much, but she didn't have anybody fighting with her. You know, she had to do it on her own. And we were there for her, but you no, know, it really was all her.